Funny thing is, right when I started playing that song, dark clouds came and started raining outside, right outside the studio here. <laughs> I was actually playing and I heard this trickling sound on the window pane outside, didn't know what it was, thought it was the recording, sounded like it just stopped. Here's the uh, paperwork right there when they recorded this album. I was just researching this album last night and the whole album was recorded live in um, 12 hours with very few overdubs. Uh, one day they went in the studio and recorded live. Very few takes, less takes than what I'm doing. And the next day, they mixed it and did a couple more uh, uh, just a couple more overdubs with the guitars and vocals, but not really a whole lot. Majority of the album was played live, according to Tony Iommi, Bill Ward, and Ozzy Osbourne from the research I've done. That version I played was the, obviously was not the final mix version, but that was the instrumental version without the vocals, before the vocals got mixed. And you can notice at the end, when I played on, on that particular version, um, the cymbals were not choked. They, they just rang out. And I choked mine because I didn't know what was going on. rain stopped outside. This is the uh, deluxe expanded ed edition of the debut album. actually a woman 
It was a model. Everybody thinks that's Ozzy. It's not. Here's the original album. Just the original five tracks. The color on the cover is slightly different. Released by Warner Brothers. On the original vinyl, I believe when you opened up the vinyl like this, there was the inverted cross, but they didn't put it on the CD version. I believe it was banned. There's the Ludwig front head on Bill Ward's kit. And the lights just flickered. And uh, again, um, I believe it was the uh, Ludwig um, gray, um, uh, what's the call? I'm sorry, hold on. It was the gray ripple oyster looking pearl kit. The gray ripple oyster pearl looking color kit. Seen in early Sabbath photos and videos, I believe was the kit used on the album. Sometimes I think that the slingerling kit was used as well. The white marine pearl slingerling kit. But who knows? I, wa I was not there. This is my um, Black Sabbath, the end tour, 2016, 2017. Pretty cool. Thanks, guys, for watching. Uh, we got some more Black Sabbath drum videos coming. Going to focus more on the uh, on the Aussie years, um, and again, thanks for watching. Thank you.